Test 65, section four, question six. Um, I'll just read it. It says, the calm, shallow waters of coastal estuaries are easily polluted by nutrient-rich sewage. I can see that. That makes sense to me. Seems like a fact. Um, when estuary waters become over-nutrified, as a result, algae proliferate. Okay. okay. The abundant algae, in turn, sometimes provide a rich food source for microorganisms that are toxic to fish, thereby killing most of the fish in the estuary. Jeez. You know, it sounds like a set of facts, and they kind of make sense, and they seem to flow together. So it seems like when you pollute, you end up killing fish. Um, that's my reaction to this passage. You? Yeah. You know, nutrient-rich sounds good. Sewage, of course, sounds bad. Yeah, but nutrient rich, mm -hmm. I could be like, oh shit, that might be actually good, you know, whatever. Maybe, mm -hmm. Hey, shit is fertilizer, right? So maybe this is good. But they turn around and say, well, thing is, you're going to get algae, then the algae are going to become these food source for microorganisms that are toxic to fish, you know, bacteria, whatever. And then that's going to kill most of the fish in the estuary. Damn. Okay. That sounds, so it sounds like this pollution is bad because yeah. it's going to kill fish. I'm expecting a must be true question. Yes, it's just a set of facts. So it seems like that's what they give us. And they do. They said, which one following can be properly inferred from the information above. Properly inferred means must be true. So what must be true given what was said? Okay. A, fish in the estuary that has been polluted by sewage are generally more likely to die from pollution than our fish in an estuary that has been polluted in some other way. I'm going to reject that because I have no idea what happens when it's polluted in other ways. I would have stopped reading that one somewhere in the middle, you know, somewhere between generally and the end of the sentence. Sure. Um, must be true questions. We need something that's been proven by the facts. I don't know that generally really anything. I mean, I, most I of the that, time, yeah. Mm -hmm. I know that sewage can sometimes. I don't know that anything generally anything. Cool. Okay. B in estuary waters that contain abundant algae microorganisms that are toxic to fish reproduce more quickly than other types of microorganisms? Um, again, it's a comparison that I don't know. We never um, say the words out of scope, but if we were going to say the words out of scope, we would probably do that on a must be true question. Mm -hmm. When we look at an answer choice that brings up new shit. Yep. That's what I would say. I like shit. new shit better because I like new shit way like better vague. than out of scope. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's like vague. People it's are like, like, why are you bringing up new down. shit? I thought we were talking about sewage, estuary, algae, microorganisms, killing fish. Why are you bringing up other microorganisms that are not toxic to fish? That was not in the facts. So we can't pick any answer that talks about microorganisms that are not toxic to fish. Yep. It's new shit. Okay. New shit. C, nutrients and other components of sewage do not harm fish in coastal estuaries in any, other, in any way other than through the resulting proliferation of toxic microorganisms. Well, I, <laughs> I didn't need to read all that. Um, when it says in any other way, like, or any way other than this, it's like, okay, I just don't, again, it's new shit. I don't know about other ways. So yeah, all the other ways that sewage might hurt, I mean, it might hurt them directly. Like it yeah. just might have fucking poison in it that kills mm -hmm. fish. Right. Yep. We don't know. So we can't pick that out. D algae will not prolif pro proliferate, proliferate. I have to work on my pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Algae will not proliferate in coastal estuaries that are not polluted by nutrient rich sewage. Huh? Um, we don't know about those coastal estuaries that are not polluted. So again, this is new shit. It's wrong. Better yep. be E. E, over nutrifying estuary waters. We did talk about that. By sewage, we did talk about that. Can result in the death of most of the fish in the estuary. Um, 
The word most here is strong, but the passage itself said thereby killing most of the fish in the estuary. So yep. it's supported by the passage. This is like essentially restating it. Some people might even not like this answer because they're like, well, the passage already said that. That's, That's exactly the point. Answer. That's what yeah. we're looking for. And there is one word there that we love on this type of a question. Oh, this yes. is a top down, must be true type of a question. There's one word there that really softens it, mm -hmm. can. which is can. Yeah. 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 Can means can't possibly sometimes. Well, hey, they told us a whole story about this. So apparently yep. it can happen. And so I'm 100% like I totally, you know, can vouch for and that's how you should feel on these top-down questions where it's just like, yep, uh, it's totally supported by the given facts. I don't have to add anything to it. It's perfect. Yeah. So the answer is... My it. other favorite word like can is... Can you guess? <laughs> um, I mean, I really like may. May. That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. Like, may, can might. Can you disagree with may? <laughs> could. Mm -hmm. Yep. Any of those kind of... So now, that doesn't... Don't take that too far. Some people are going to be like, well, it said can, so I picked it. I'm like, that's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> I remember when you said in the show that if the answer said can or may, it's correct. <laughs> no, it's not what we said. But we do <clears throat> prefer a more weakly worded answer. Anything that's too strongly worded is we're going to be real skeptical of it because the facts have to justify whatever that strong language was. And yeah. uh, it's real easy to prove can. So <clears throat> they gave us facts that this can happen. So we are perfectly happy to vouch for the idea that this can happen. So the answer is E. Yeah.